buddies, this is Miss Evelyn. I'm back with another autumn story for us today. We love autumn. Don't we love autumn? We see little acorns falling from the trees, and that's the title of our book today. Little Acorn, Discover an Amazing Story from the Natural World. The author is Melanie Joyce, and the illustrator is Gina Maldonado. Let's get started. When I was just an acorn, nobody noticed me. I watched the world below go by from high up in the tree. I nestled under cozy leaves and sheltered from the rain. Growing and growing, fatter and shiny when the sun came out again. When the summer faded, the leaves turned golden brown. Bye-bye, acorn, said the leaves, floating to the ground. Wait for me, I called, then ready, steady, jump. I tumbled through the air and landed with a thump. Squirrel was collecting nuts for his winter store. He hid me carefully away beneath the forest floor. Underground, everything was snugly and still. I waited very patiently for time to pass until I felt a sudden changing deep inside. I'm feeling so peculiar. What's happening? I cried. You're growing up, said the worms, all wriggling about. When acorns fall into the soil, at some point they will sprout. I giggled as I felt tickly, teeny tiny shoots. And before I knew it, I had sprouted little roots. There's his little roots. I started to stretch up, wiggling left and right, reaching up and up till I pushed out into the light. See his roots are growing in the soil and that makes him big and strong. Warmed by gentle sunbeams, my little leaves unfurled. I was so excited to be back out in the world. As weeks and months passed by, I grew and grew and grew. Squirrel spotted me and said, I've been looking everywhere for you. The seasons changed and so did I. In sunshine, in the rain, in the snow, my branches stretched, my trunk grew tall, my roots spread far below. Among my sturdy branches, the birds built cozy nests. My twigs and leaves made soft warm beds for my feathered guests. They're the birds in the trees. Spiders moved their sticky webs and beetles scurried by. Squirrels scampered playfully and made their homes up high. The creatures of the forest had never seen a finer tree. I wondered would there ever be another one like me. From a little acorn he turned into a beautiful tree. Then one breezy morning I woke up with a yawn, I stretched my branches and jumped out a special little oh, acorn. There's the acorn falling from the acorn tree. Look at the acorn smile. Every oak tree starts life as a seed called an acorn, growing on and on and on until the acorn drops from the ground into the soil where it sprouts roots. As the roots grow down, a leafy shoot sprouts up, growing taller and taller. The acorn is now a baby tree called a seedling. It continues to grow bigger and bigger until it is now a new oak tree. 
and grows acorns of its own. That's the cycle of life. And that's the end of our story. Little acorns turn into great big trees. That's the end of our story, book buddies. See you next time on Storytime with Miss Evelyn. Don't forget to wash your hands.